Oh shit, it's not allowing me to place anything except the afterburner. All the other things show like a, a gr uh, yellow, uh, no, yellow, freaking red, grid. What the hell? Why is that not possible? Uh, maybe it only works on certain vehicles. Like, uh, I guess, vanilla vehicles. Yeah, because this afterburner is part of the aircraft mod. It's not uh, Bob's or what's not. Damn it. No, I thought I could pimp my plane with more than just an afterburner. Uh, does it like... Although this needs electricity. So clearly it's got to be in consumption with Bob's thing. Well, let's insert one of these and see. No, they don't work. Damn it, how the hell are you supposed to get energy then? Uh, can I insert one of these? Oops. Yeah, those actually work. <laughs> I could put a, s a fusion reactor in there. Let's make one of those. Ten times. That's not too long. Let's switch this into... Level 3 solar panels, even though they don't work on this vehicle, but maybe they do in some... Kablam! There we go, fusion reactor. <laughs> now it's got plenty of power. Could do some... Although... Hmm, maybe I should put a shield in there instead. The portable fusion reactor is so huge. Can't fit a shield. Wait a minute, aircraft energy shield, aha, so there's a, here's a, a shield part of the aircraft mod. And that one's Mark Three. is there an aircraft battery as well? I don't think so. All of these are Bob's Warfare. Looks like I still have Mark One exoskeleton, so let's upgrade that. And uh, let's upgrade all of these that I can. I don't think there's a Mark II for the fusion reactor, though, or the Roboport. Uh, except these things need uh, gems, which I don't have. Discharge defense. Hmm. Let's try that. Exoskeleton 3, personal Roboport, night vision. I don't need night vision. Holy shit, the uh, discharge defense requires 10 laser turrets. Damn, but how does it... Uh, compared to the personal laser defense. And does that require laser turrets? No. <laughs> Interesting. What mod is this from? It's actually a vanilla thing. I forgot about that. I think I tried it at some point. It uses like these things. Alright, I pimped my rides. The car has uh, overdrive engine, some uh, solar panels and a vehicle robot port. Oh, I don't know if does it need to have Construction robots uh, in the inventory. Oh shit, looks like I need more ammunition. Let's take the new ammo. And then this one has the plasma cannon mark two. Some more uh, solar panels, robot power, shield, and overdrive engine. While well, the plane has the afterburner, shield, uh, solar panels, and battery. <laughs> These seem to work despite them being meant for the power armor stuff. Can't put uh, like this shield doesn't work, the overdrive doesn't work, the plasma cannon doesn't work. After oh, I could fit another afterburner. <laughs> Maybe it goes even faster. Well, anyway, now let's uh, pick these up, take them with me. Let's hope I have enough inventory space. Huh, looks like the uh, grid uh, things are... Uh, Visible there, and they don't end up in my inventory. Very nice. Let's take them with me, go get some lithia, and also test the tank on an enemy base nearby. Because I want to see what the plasma cannon does, because it doesn't seem to have any, like, ammo or any way to fire it. Maybe it's automatic. Alright, I'm ready to roll out. I decided to add another water pump jack over here, because I had one in my inventory. From before when I was over here, I also have these to add somewhere. There we go. Uh, plenty of lithium water in there now, and this thing is full as well. I'm gonna have to pick up the rest into my inventory, but first go to battle, we shall. Autobots roll out. Uh, one on the left, one on the right. What was that? Trigger an alien attack by pollution. Oh shit. 
Yes, that means they will attack somewhere soon, but where is the question? There's no pollution over there, surprisingly. Huh? How the hell are these not producing any pollution? That must mean they're not producing anything, so the uh, chest must be full. There's some over there. Of course, my main base producing a lot. There's a lot on those two. And some over there. Not much there. Oh, shit. Is that where they attacked? Must have been from there. Hmm, maybe I should uh, fly over there with my tank. Well, then again, I'm already over here, so let's uh, choose a place to attack. There's a lot of trees over there, but then again, they will be destroyed thanks to the mod. Let's see if I go. Ah, looks like it... Oh, yeah, I forgot. It only works on the car, I think. Oh, well, I can charge through the forest, or I can just destroy it with this thing. Then again, let's see if I am move really slowly will it still destroy the trees. Yeah, pretty much. What if I back into one? Yeah, and I haven't even lost any hit points after all. This is the tank mark 2. Speaking of which, can I build the mark uh, 3? And where is it? Under logistics. Uh, yeah, there it is. Nope, requires tungsten. Oh well. Um, let's try the uh, artillery thing first. Although it's getting dark. And uh, the map is al also in the way, so maybe I'll switch to that side. Look at my shield. <laughs> it looks like the uh, robots are immediately repairing it. But are they coming from this robot port or mine? I don't know. Let's add some robots in there just in case. It looks like my shield got totally depleted by that, though. Does it deplete when I... Yeah. Damn it. That sucks. It only takes, like, one hit. Uh, despite it being a Mark II. Those damn uh, solar panels aren't producing enough. I need that freaking uh, fusion power thing. Hmm. Does the poison work on trees? Let's fire it. I can't fire it. Damn it. Must need a target. Well, we can use the Bunker Buster to make some room. <laughs> it illuminates the skies around it as a oh whole man. Frames dropping like crazy. Kablam! Oh, 12 frames. Damn. Look at that hole. That's what she said or he said. <laughs> so much debris from that explosion. Oh, they're already right there. I thought they were farther away. Let's see if I can fire with the artillery. Come on, why is it not firing? Fire, fire, what's the range? There we go. Oh, come on, that sucks. And those guys are green, so they're probably actually immune to the poison. Fire, what the fuck? There we go. Bam. Let's switch to the Bunker Buster. Kablamo. And then finish them off with some machine gunnery. Oh, actually, I should have ran into the uh, into the buildings because there's an achievement for destroying like ten buildings or something. Oh, damn it! That guy was green, but he didn't drop any green. They just dropped the normal freaking stuff. Come on! Well, there's an orange one there, or is it red? I don't know. Damn it! How many aliens do I have to kill to get special colors? Seems like a lot. These just drop the stupid purple ones. Maybe they have to be like influenced by uh, by pollution to drop more colorful ones. Although I still didn't see the plasma cannon in action. It could have been my per uh, my personal uh, laser defense that fired something, but maybe it was the plasma cannon. I thought I saw some sort of green projectile thing coming out. Let's head to the other uh, other base and whop it out as well. And let's swoop around and get them on my ass and then we can see the plasma cannon hopefully in action. Oh man, those are huge. Look at it. Oh, that's my personal thing, but that explosive thing, that's the plasma cannon. Oh yeah, it's doing quite a lot of damage. Boom! That didn't do much to those guys. What about the artillery? It missed. Can I like fire it? There we go. I fired it preemptively. It's not doing anything. Damn, those are huge. So big. Let's finish him off with... Oh shit. Where's my uh, machine gun? There we go. 
<laughs> the plasma cannon even destroyed some of the trees. There we go. But <laughs> they keep dropping the normal tiny ones, goddammit. They should only drop the special ones because the... Oh, then again, yeah, of course they need to also drop the tiny ones because uh, not everyone has the uh, alien artifacts mod installed like I do. Let's fire the bunker buster and charge into one of the buildings. Boom! Oh, they all got destroyed. Oh shit! They dropped, uh, stopped me in my tracks. Gotta get away and finish them off with some machine gun fire. Speaking of the machine gun, I can't use the uh, Bob's bullets because they're not armor piercing. Those guys would eat them up for breakfast. Where's that robot going? Come on, come back and keep repairing me. Where the hell is it going? <laughs> I guess it's like uh, repairing where I used to be. There we go. All patched up and looks like this base is done. There we go, all cleaned up and I was thinking about that attack over here. Maybe I should let them attack because then they would evolve more and once I do swoop in hopefully they will drop more colorful things like this uh, freaking trip only yielded one purple, one orange, one red and way too many uh, pink ones to count. I don't want more of those, I want the other colors. Oh, damn it, I can't even carry all the lithium water with me because the tank had so, so many cannon shells in its uh, um, trunk. Oh, well, this is more than plenty. Why is the stack size only 20, though? 715 barrels in there after they filled up the uh, conveyor belt fully. That should last quite a while because they have like 25 lithium water in each and... Uh, one of, 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 of those requires 2.5. Damn, this thing <laughs> rotates super fast. Now it like kind of even twitches. Or maybe it's just my FPS. Then again, it is, it is a steady 60 all the time. And I'm doing that. Oh well, let's uh, dump the tank out so I don't have to carry its ammunition. Same with the car. Alright, back to the matter at hand, which was the uh, sulfuric acid shortage. I can't remember what even happened. Why did I get distracted uh, from the iron that is over here, which we can combine with that uh, uh, sulfur right there. I guess this is as good as place as any right here. And the uh, uh, pipe is right here. I can use that as well. Should be pretty easy to connect to that. Just put these like here. Like so. Get some of that stuff from down here. And then... Um, <coughs> I guess I could do a splitter for this stuff here. But which way? Because it's going both ways right here. <laughs> Doesn't really matter. Let's just use this one here. Uh, yeah, I can go, like, go around this way and that way. I still need to fit the pipes though, shouldn't be too much of a problem. These can go there. The tunnel comes from that way. And there it comes and then the recipe is right there. Give these people some power. Give the power to the people. And these can fit right about there. I don't even need that there. And uh, yeah, that is the right pipe. That was pretty easy. Weren't they? Uh, oh shit, I forgot about the water. The water, of course. Forgot about that. I can just do it from here. Um, Maybe they should have their own pipe because these guys use like two each, meaning a total of ten, which is what the pipe can handle. Damn it, there's a hydrogen pipe in the way here. Um, although I can go down on this one, <laughs> that's what she said, like this. But what about that one? 
I could go all the way over here. Yeah, might as well go all the way down there and have their own little offshore pump where I get all of this stuff to put it in there. I need uh, steel pipes to get that far. Let it flow, let it flow, there it flows. Gotta love these offshore pumps, how they don't require any electricity. Huh, seems like it uh, is not enough, although now it's catching up. It's almost at 10 all the time, dipping to like 8 every once in a while. But anyway, these are lo a godsend because they don't require electricity. Without them, I would be screwed like over here if the steam engines stop. Like I was at one point when I was using uh, those pump things back when they used to uh, draw water out of nothing. Alright, that should speed the uh, sulfuric acid production along. Let's make sure there's no uh, uh, pumps or uh, non-return valves on this thing. I don't think so. Do these guys also require it? I think yes, they do. That's why it's uh, gone. I've added so many things recently that require sulfuric acid, like... Uh, well, not these, uh, but uh, the uh, uh, weapon stuff or ammo stuff over there requires it. Looks like the amount of sulfuric acid is slowly growing in that container, so let's uh, hope these two were enough to make it happen. Uh, where was it needed the most? Oh yeah, it was the, not the CPUs, but the component things somewhere over here. Uh, the, uh, these things. It's got one, how many does it need? Where is it? That one needs 0.5, so it's got a full amount. Why is it not producing any? Oh, it's missing silicon wafers. What's up with them? Uh, there's no silicon on this thing. Because they're missing carbon. Oh, now there's some freaking coal again. What the hell? Why does it keep stopping? Is there another tunnel somewhere facing the wrong way? Nope. Uh, there's no coal at all over here. So could it have actually... Run out, damn it. Yeah, looks pretty damn empty. How the hell? I thought I, when I, like, last time I looked at this... Yeah, look at that. There's plenty of coal in it. Why is it not getting over here, then? Let's find the train. There it is. About to load. Oh, it looks like they're all done, yeah, because I don't have any large area ones there. <laughs> Although on the map it kind of looks like they still would have stuff that's uh, confusing. I guess it doesn't update the map like it's supposed to. Where's my plane? I think it's right there. I need to go reposition those things. There we go. That should keep things running for a while over here. Uh, so now that I'm actually here, let's connect the uh, tungsten right here. Titanium is probably nowhere near running out. Let's have a look at it over here. And again, looks like maybe half of it is done. And iron on the other hand. Uh, where is it? Over here is such a massive deposit, it's not going to run out for a while. Uh, so let's just connect this stuff. 5,000, 4,000, 6,000, 3,000. What about this one? Has much less, like 1,200, 2,000, 3,000. That stuff is uh, 1,300, 15, 14, 16, not even 2,000, damn it. What about that stuff? Only 11, 1,200. So this is like clearly the most dense one of them all. Well, it looks like I can cover it with two of these, pretty much. Plasma Cannon 3 is finally done, so let's switch to Fusion Reactor for the vehicles. And figure these out, maybe a few more of the fast ones somewhere. 